Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another Planet Coaster video. So today, what I'm going to do for you is I'm going to do a complete time lapse and I'm going to talk over the time lapse as it's going. So what we're going to do is we're going to build up a um, a castle. And this castle is going to be kind of a food court area. I might put a ride in here. I, I kind of like the idea of trying to get a roller coaster to run through the um, this thing as like going through the walls and up and over and all sorts of things so we'll try around with that probably next episode but today we're just gonna build up this coaster uh, also I get a lot of questions about the music of this game uh, what do I use what's the song name uh, it's the main theme song or the main menu song of the game itself so what I did was I just went to the the front of the game or the menu screen I let it idle for 20 minutes recorded the video or recorded the audio from it and the video and um, then I put it in the game. So, or I put it in these videos, I saved it and let it go. So let's get talking about the building. What has gone on? Well, I started building up a square. You can see that there was a square uh, in the beginning of the video. And then I made uh, a cut back, made a little cut back in that corner right here. And this corner, what happened was there's a little dip there that goes next to that giant swing thing. And I had to cut it back in the corner and kind of make it a notched out of it. I kind of like that though, it gave it a little more texture little bit different kind of working with the terrain so I like that uh, this next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna build up a keep in the background here and the keep itself is gonna um, this is gonna be where the the food court is or I guess what could be called a food court we'll get to that in a little bit but uh, we'll try building this up it did take me a little bit of time to get um, the angles correct on this trying to figure out which way to look the best I didn't want to do one on one side and one on the other side so I just decided hey Let's put all of it outside and make sure we have it lined up. Well, then we'll bust open an entry after we'll make up a little front. There's the entry coming in. Very good. Very good indeed. Uh, then there's these little things. I found these. I saw those in there and I thought, hey, you know what? Why don't we try adding in um, some sort of texture on the front of these? And we'll see how it looks. We can always take things out once we add them in too. It's like pretty good. I wanted to see what it looked like with uh, raising these up a little bit, the corners. I don't know what the corners of a castle are called. I guess I should have looked that up before I, I made the video. But uh, yeah, I, I like the way it looked. Add in the arm ring on the bottom side of it. Looks pretty good. Uh, the one complaint I have with this game right now is that there's no way, like we could pause it. You could pause the game, but then you don't have any of the sound in the background. You don't have any of the, like the people walking around. It doesn't feel alive. I wish you could just um, pause where the sun is. And I did suggest that to the developers. And hopefully that'll get in. So like, pause it in the morning. Pause the time, but let the people continue walking around. I mean, it's a sandbox. We're in a sandbox game, so why not? I mean, there's no campaign. There's no reason for time other than to see. And if we could just adjust where the sun was, I think that'd be good. Cool. So we got all of our towers up. It looks pretty good. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to add one on the outside. Um, kind of wanted to break up this long wall. And I'm gonna bump it out. My chair is squeaking. <laughs> Shoot. I thought I had the audio turned off for it. But yeah, we're bumping into the wall and I didn't really like the way that looked. It didn't stick out enough. So let's delete it and then we're gonna add uh, one to it. Or one wall chunk on the outside. And then we'll raise that back up. And I like that a lot better. I gave it a little more texture and, and just a little bit of a bounce on the outside. Then we'll see how it works with um, walls all the way around it. I like it. So we got the walls. We're going to do an interior wall too. No castle is good with only an uh, exterior wall. So we'll do a little interior one. And it kind of comes together a little bit wonky, especially with the tree in the way. Uh, but we have to slide it over and attach it to one. We'll just finish up the other side too. Like that. Cool. Looks good looks great and we're gonna add these little things on the top uh, eventually we're gonna tear these out I wanted it to be well no we added those on we left those on but the ones on the walls we can add them on the wall these ones uh, I did tear these out and we put in the half blocks first so and they kind of came out it was too low so I don't know we'll see uh, I haven't completely finished it off yet at the time of recording this so I just wanted to see what happens and adding windows in I know it's not the most are the the best way to build a castle having windows in the walls a weak point is never a good thing but hey you know what it's a video game and it's gonna have a roller coaster in it so why not doesn't really matter doing some archways in the entryway so we can put some 
uh, hallway in, and I kind of I really messed up on the the front entry. Uh, I couldn't figure out the, a good way to to get windows in there, so I tinkered around with it quite a bit, and then it got dark dark out again. So I mean, it's so difficult to see when it's dark. Yeah, I couldn't quite figure it out. Eventually, I do. Uh, what I did was I offset it by one instead of offsetting it by two that the walls were doing, and then that was a little bit easier. So we're gonna do that and hit memory counting. Yep. Okay, and deleting those and putting that in and moving it over one didn't do anything. So let's actually move it one piece. We'll slide it back, and it looks great. That is so much better. It is centered. We'll put in a little eyeballs in there, and then we have our, our derpy little door inside that I don't know what to do with, so let's just <laughs> offset it. I like that better. New walls in the inside. Good. See that? Dropped a block in. Dropping it in again. I should have just done the auto stacking, uh, but there was some sort of weird measurement thing. So just keep on doing it. And I cut that one all the way inside. That was fine. Keep on going around. Cool, that's a pretty good start, isn't it? Nice little base that we've got going on. And uh, the reason I notched those out is because I wanted to put a, uh, like a, a staircase up, or mm, what's the word? Staircase or a, a ramp up so people could walk on it. That's the only ride right there that'll fit inside. I don't know if I like that or not. So I do want to put in the sidewalks now. And I did six wide, I think it was, a width of six. and. It did take quite a bit of time to, to get the angles lined up. So uh, what I decided to do is work backwards. And we couldn't quite make a, a direct cut there because it ended at a, a little bit off. So we've got a little bit of the sidewalk on the inside. Yeah, you see it takes a kind of a monumental feat to get it to link up. Even with it holding control down and doing all of this stuff, I, I just couldn't, couldn't get it right. So some of these are going to be a little bit wonky on angles. Uh, especially on this left side. <laughs> it really did take a long time to get. And this is like four times faster, so can you imagine how long I was tinkering with this. I should have, looking back on it, I should have put the roads down first. Um, that's one thing the developers told me when I was in that press event was uh, do the roads first when you plan things out. And you can make them square, you can make them how you want. And I didn't. didn't. Ah, there we go. That works good enough for me. Good. And this was a little bit of a nasty corner too. So I don't, I don't know. Um, I kind of wish I would have, but I, I don't think it lines up the same. But it works. It was good enough. And what did I do now? I was trying to figure out a way to cover up the, the walkway, but I couldn't. So let's attach the two together. And... Uh, I was going to do it this way to begin with, but then I didn't like the shape that this made. I didn't, um, well, yeah. So I kind of deleted that, uh, or will delete that, and work backwards. Ooh, the shadow. I love the shadows in this game. But let's work up a little bit. We'll move it over, and it, it doesn't look as bad as what it did if we do it that way. And then it's square. We have a nice little keep in there. I may do some other things inside on that uh, little corner on the left there. And then this is where I deleted it and put the, the other parapets on. Is that what they're called, parapets? Maybe. I'm not sure. The half blocks on top makes it so you can't quite see over it, but it's just enough that I could put a walkway in on the top row and people could walk across. So we'll try that. Hopefully we can get that working. It's going great. Cool. That one's ready, and that one's ready. I did not complete the inside totally. Uh, the inner keep put some of these on just to hide the inside, nothing more. Sick of putting some cannons up there, and then some other decorations, but we'll do that later. I want to get the roller coaster in first, and then we can do some other things, decorating and making everything look nice. Because it's going to be very, very difficult to get everything working right in here. Now, especially with the tight angles of a roller coaster. I might have to bring them outside the walls and bring it back in. I don't know. I haven't even thought about that yet. But I, I have a feeling you guys would like to see a roller coaster within a castle. So that's kind of what my plan is. Got the last ones in. Good. Cool. So let's uh, 
I'm gonna put some of these on the outside because it was just a little bit blah. I didn't like the corner, how sharp the corner was. So we'll work with these. And I think that was one short, right? Yep, that was one short. Had to delete it and we'll add one more on. Cool. Next stage is getting these on. I didn't really like putting those on. <laughs> the game didn't seem to like it either. There we go. Delete the corners out. Add a little bit more to these. Cool. It looked good. It looks really good. I like how that looks. And you can hear me sighing. <laughs> Maybe. Why didn't I turn the microphone off when I was building this? That was dumb. Okay, so my next thought was I was going to create uh, something that worked all together, and I had a really hard time with this. So the problem I had was the building itself, like the, the main castle building, didn't quite work right on the grid with placing down these buildings and then the walkway. So I decided to take them off and try making them their own individual buildings, and that didn't work. You can see here I'm messing with it as part of the bigger building. It's just not snapping, and I can't rotate at all. It's just, it was frustrating. So I figured I'd make my own buildings and uh, try to see what I could deal with. And you can't make, like, those two restrooms. They couldn't be the same. Um, couldn't be in the same building either. So I added some blocks on the side to kind of block it off and do the same thing over here so it doesn't you can't see in there and we're gonna do the same with these we're gonna block these up so we have a nice little enclosed walking area cool I like it and then let's put in uh, the green one I don't know what this was I also had problems with this thing um, being part of the main building just did not want to attach so delete it add my own and, yep, see, nothing attaches to that front correctly. Except pathway doesn't even really. So I just deleted it. <laughs> I deleted the whole thing, but I needed to come back and just delete that. And we can just put in a regular one. Make it straight. And there we go. It's a little bit off on the corners, but being on so inside like this, I don't think it'll matter too much. Just getting these in. All right, we got our flooring on now on that top thing. And we'll try to hook up the uh, walkways to it. I like the way that these turned out. Um, you can't make a courtyard. I really wish you could make a courtyard in the game, but it just doesn't work right. Uh, and then we put on those. I don't like the sharp angle at the bottom, but I do like the way that turned out in general. So we had a, a really good entry um, into it. And now the, the frustrating thing of making a road. So I'm gonna skip this making a road because it's a couple minutes long. And I'll, I'll just uh, show you the entrance here. But uh, yeah, that, that's pretty much it, guys. We're going to work on this in probably another another video of it tomorrow, trying to get all things lined up and um, looking a little bit better than it is. If you have any suggestions for this, definitely let me know. If you liked it, definitely let me know that too. And we'll keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.